There are some spots in Middle Tennessee and Southern Kentucky that seem to be tornado magnets. They are communities that have seen multiple twisters blow through over the years. As we continue our day long special reports, when seconds count, New Sioux meteorologist Davis Nolan looks at the science behind the tornado clusters. Here's a look at the number of tornadoes in Tennessee by county since 1950. Now notice how high the numbers are in Davidson, Sumner, and Wilson counties at 58, 52, and 55 respectively. And the same thing goes for Shelby County in Memphis at 56, and look at Rutherford County in Murfreesboro at 45 tornadoes. Now the reason for this has little to do with meteorology. Now besides the large size of these counties, there are higher populations, and nowadays modern communications have a lot to do with it. The more people with eyes on the sky are reporting damage, the more likely we are to get a report. And then finally, media. Tornadoes are up across the board right now across the country, probably because we are, have many more ways to report tornadoes, whether it's social media, email, phone calls. We get pictures and videos now from chasers and the public and, and our broadcast media partners. There's just a lot more information. And think about it. Back in the 1950s, a tornado could have occurred out in the countryside, and it might not necessarily have been reported. But if it went through a highly populated area, it certainly would have been. Nowadays, we'll hear about it just about anywhere a tornado occurs. I'm meteorologist Davis Nolan, News 2.